everyone, it's Michelle here. How are you all doing? Um, I just thought I'd hop on. Um, I've not been great all week. I've been really poorly since last Sunday. Last Saturday was our staff meal. Works meal. Christmas meal. And we went out. Oh, God. What an absolute farce of a night. We goes out. I picked Ellie up. I drives there and we parks up like. And we go in and... We stood around and then our mate, we're supposed to have been seated at seven and then about ten to seven the girl who organised it all went up, the woman, she's not a girl, she's a woman, uh, she went up and she said, um, you know, can we be seated now? And um, she gave a name and he said, no, sorry, there's no there's no such bucket. I like, bear in mind, there's 20 staff members stood there, dolled up at nines, you know, waiting to be seated in a pub what's packed solid, oh God. I got to the point where a fight or flight, I'm either going to hit somebody or just run because it was, oh, I don't like things like that. We're literally like, you're stood cramped up like that and there was some, you could feel people breathing at you. I was like, oh, that's not my idea of um, a nice time. I hate it. I reckon that's where I've got this thing from. Anyway, so eventually it just kept saying, no, 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 no no deposit was paid, so we cancelled it. Yeah, the deposit was paid in October, £220, so where's that? Um, no, 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 nothing's been paid. So she got, she pulled all the um, emails up where they said, thank you for your deposit. We even confirmed what we, what we was all eating on the Thursday, on the Wednesday, Thursday, we all confirmed what we was eating. So <coughs> they got all that. Um... And eventually they admitted it was their mistake. Um, and as a goodwill gesture, everybody who'd had a three-course meal could have their pudding for free. I said, well, what about me and Ellie didn't have a pudding? Because last time we went to this place, I love puddings. The last time we went to the place, the puddings weren't, desserts weren't up to no, nothing. Because we'd been there once before we work, about six years ago. And um, I said, I'm not paying for a pudding. I'm not paying like six, seven pounds for a pudding if it's going to be horrendous. So we didn't have one, me and Ellie. And uh, so all them lot got the puddings free. Us two didn't get it. What did we get? Nothing. Because what were our compensation? Our fuming. Um, so we were meant to start eating at seven and we started eating at eight. Um, and we stopped to roo for it. I had to watch that back when I got home. I was fuming. Um, and then I went to my mum's Sunday. I was perfectly fine. Went to my mum's, did a COVID test before I went because mum's got no immune system. So I did a test before I went. Uh, oh, she's got a very, it's very low. Um, and then oh, I went to my mum's laughing and joking with my sister and my nephews what were there and oh you know I had a really good time then comes home and then I thought oh I'm a bit achy about nine o'clock at night ten o'clock at night I'm really achy oh I need to go and get in bed I'm up at half past four to go to work anyway I um <clears throat> I think Bob I got in bed and then I woke up about three I felt terrible my head were banging, I were aching everywhere. This is a lot better than it was. I couldn't hardly speak the other day. Um, oh, it just felt dreadful. So I ran downstairs, got a test, got paracetamol, got a test kit, negative. Did it at night time, negative. And since last Monday, I've been doing morning and night, and it's been negative. I should say three quarters of staff have got it as well. It's it's an awful bug. Um, not very nice at all because I kept thinking oh no my mum even though I tested before I went I've been round and she gets it again she's had Covid once and she had to go into hospital and she had to have antivirals and all that lot pumped in her and, and it just yeah I just don't want it to like go through that again do you know what I mean she was really poorly and I'm thinking oh no I bet I got it from that pub there's no wonder I could feel people breathing on me oh god oh honestly and then like when it girl she got like a, she wore a corset with a blazer and a short skirt and of course everything were hanging out so you got lechy leery men looking over we're like oh god I said that cover yourself up yeah <laughs> I said we keep and I'm gonna say something in a minute but um, yeah one of them it'll fight or flight I thought I'm just gonna I'm gonna punch somebody or so I'm just gonna run in a minute I just I don't like being in confined tiny small the the pub's quite big but there were just loads of people in there and i just i expected to walk in stand for five minutes and go and sit down in a separate area for your meal not to be stood an hour like oh no 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 
Anyway, we finally sat down at eight o'clock and that rate. I said, right, that's it. We're not going next year. No way. And we're not. I'm not doing it. Uh, but yeah, so that's been... <clears throat> The craft fair were meant to be last week and this and this week coming, but not. It's just next week. I'll take some photos and I'll pop that up. Um, I finished me one of the socks. It's there. This is the no shaping sock. Um, chuck it on. Oh, oh. Let's shove it on here. I'll put it on because I've got leggings. I've got a dress on, but I've got leggings on. So um, I'll show you. There it is there it's um can't get me like a pile off <laughs> there it's all right it's nice and warm you know when you you know you want to knit socks but i can't knit other just the thought of it puts the fear of god into me knitting socks <laughs> honestly that's off to you what does it but oh my god a bit like crocheting 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 i should say um that does as well um so that's been my week poorly all week not i've come home literally paracetamol up and ibuprofen all week and then just come home and just vegged out i've been trying to get the cardigan done of minis i've like i would say nearly halfway on the sleeve now so i'm trying to crack on with that um so I mean, she's been really patient i've been doing it ages but not really got on with it that well um it's a beautiful day i've got my bedding out that's nearly dry i'm going to fetch that in in a minute just run iron over it and go and pop it back on um and i think i don't know whether to go to my mum i'm in a quandary i don't know whether to go to my mum's tomorrow i might ring her and see what she wants me to do so obviously i've got over the cold now but i don't know so if not, she'll still do my dinner and I'll pick it up anyway. But yeah, <coughs> and that's me. <coughs> it's left me like a particularly dry cough. I've done another test this morning and it's still negative. So um, I can't do any more than that. It's not COVID. It's not at all. But, um, but yeah. Um, last week, next week, we break up Friday at six o'clock. So I'm on an eight. So yeah, we'll break up at six next week, next Friday. Um, uh, and then that's we have a week off and we go back on the second I think it is the second or the third something like that we go back on um, yeah back to work can't wait for the week off um, right take care you lovely lot I'll speak to you all soon bye